ano. Oh. It's just a dent. Hey guys, it's TMO back here with another video where today we're going to be playing some more automation and then exporting to PMNG Drive. Not to be. Honestly, I don't know what we're going to be doing. Just something. I tried to. Uh, I tried to record this video multiple times, but neither of them went how I liked, so I just deleted the footage. Right, so, um, I'm not really sure. Just gotta wait for these things to load, and that's why I usually start from there. Just fixing something like that now. Alright, so, um, I'm not really sure. I think I might want to do a performance SUV slash hatchback I don't really care wagon Um, hmm, honestly I like that 2007 wagon, so why not? Yeah, for the panel material, aluminum will be fine. I'm not sure how much power I want to be making. I think some my space frame <sighs> Nah, some my space frame all the way, that's what I'm gonna go with Alright, instead of monocock Front longitudinal, maybe put a twin turbo V6 or something like that in it Dual wishbone or double wish one will be fine. So my trailing on also might do double wish bomb though. Um nah, so my trailing on will be fine. That'll be fun. V 90 degree V6. I'm just gonna make it an absolute tank. I'm gonna go for like 3.5 meters. Yeah. It'll take that. Yeah, that would be alright. Do over here, cam, 4 valves per cylinder. Four valve, eight load. There you go. Um, I'm just gonna go. Though it's steel, lightweight titanium might be forged. Make the quality insanely great. Ten, ten to five or ten point five to one will be fine. Not sure what the 80 is big, but it's fine. Twin turbo, twin ball bearing turbos. Now, uh, this will most likely, I'm just gonna tune them for torque.
so I'm not gonna put a bunch of boost direct injunct injection per cylinder race usually fits the bill gonna go for premium shoot that's a lot uh, 8,000 will be R8 60 I'm a tuning 12.5 yeah that'll be R8 too little exhaust no valves 3.25 color converter baffled muffler and then a first flow muffler that's a good amount of horsepower. Um, mm, I'm sure. Oh shoot! With better, with better gas, it actually doesn't do anything. Wait, wait, that dang worst gas action. Oh, oh, it, I'm pretty sure. Mess with the fuel mixture, mixture properly, probably. I'm gonna tune in a tiny bit more work. I don't want the curve to be that bad. It kind of hurts the curve a little bit. How's the engine bay quite full? It's only a 3.5 liter V6. It's not. Compared to a lot of engines, that's not all too big. At least for like. For a lot of cars. Wait. Sound test. Alright, yeah, that's pretty nice, isn't it? We've got the big in. Uh, yep, it's a big big in. Yeah. I don't really like really big cars. Really long vehicles. Is that the widest? Oh, uh, that's actually very wide. I can't be making it that wide. Too much of a white boy. Mm. I always see cars that look like kind of like this, where the rear doors are bigger than the front ones. I like to have it just in the middle. I can really make this look like a BMW if I, you know, I'm gonna try and make it look. Ooh, that's bright red, Com especially compared to the uh, to the red that it was just on. No, maybe bronze wheels, but like, no, I'm not sure they. Nope. Actually. Are they like white or black? Looks the best with bronze wheels. I'm gonna put white just for fun. Now, I've got. These are definitely not copyrighted, right? Definitely. Uh, it's, it's not a BMW. Not at all. No. 
no intentions of it being in a BMW at all. Mm -hmm. Maybe I could have had one of these or something. I don't know. Oof. Come on. Pretty fine. Now, uh, hmm. Remember what I said? It's, it's definitely not a, uh, definitely not a BMW, huh? Yeah, definitely not a BMW. Definitely not a BMW. Mm -mm, no, no reference at all to a BMW. Wait, I forget how the BMWs look. Actually, I remember no intention of being a BMW at all. I'm probably gonna go with these ones. These look alright. Be fine, and then uh, up here. No, I'm just gonna put in carbon fiber. Only reason why I'm putting it in carbon fiber is because whenever you're in game, it actually looks like a matte black or something. Ooh. We right. Um, in terms of, just put a shield bar on right here. No, that that should do the trick. No, I'm just kidding. Alright, yeah, that's way too big. It's a big one. Door handles. Check. Tips. They're big enough. Oh, what a what about this? This one's so again, I'm going to look at all the trims. Oh all trims. They need to be white trims. Here's pillar. Oh no, actually plastic plastic well actually I guess I'll, I want all the trims to be plastic then Are the mirrors that doesn't make any sense. 
or for nothing. It's fine. And you get some sporty looking Maji. Well, the features seem to be there that are... Hmm? Maybe a hood vent or two and I'll be fine. Just gonna make them a bit shorter. Yeah, those look fine. All wheel drive is a must. In my opinion, anything that has like over around probably like 600 horsepower in this game needs to have all wheel drive. Oh no, what is this? That's the thing about this game sometimes though, is that you have to fix all the little imperfections that happen. They most likely be using either... Mm, this is an SUV, so yeah, the gears, why not? I think it'll hit 215. 242 will be fine. Electric LSD. Sports compound. Dang, 255 squared. I think I want. I'm not sure if that's enough meat. Alright, 275s is fine. 275s in the rear, 265s in the front. Well, actually, in real life, they, they wouldn't make it like that. They would make it so close. They would probably do a squared setup. So that way, whenever someone wants to buy tires or something like that, I'm eat. I'm gonna put the big brake. Then you stop. Yeah, it's fine. A little bit of brake airflow, you know. Gotta make them brakes. Cool. Carbon ceramics. Very expensive in real life. Most cars don't have them. But you know, this is a game, so what do you expect? Luxury sat nav, because I don't really care about weight. You know, safe. Has to be a safe man. Safe one, my G. Uh, that's a good. That's a good bit off the ground. Let's see this right to my liking. I'm gonna call this one Team Motors. X. Wagon X. Yeah. I don't know why. 
I don't know. It has to be like an X5 or something like that. Yeah, and I'll see you whenever this guy is done exporting. Alright guys, now we're back in the MMG Drive and yeah, the car looks pretty good. So as you can see right there, the carbon turned out to look exactly as I thought, map block. And yeah, let's test it and it's power. Oh my god, I actually made it. Oh, that, that was... I did not think I was gonna make it. Saudi Arabian style. Let's put it out of its misery. Yep. It's now dead. Alright. It was pretty powerful to my to my sense. You know. We're gonna climb up this place. That was, that was just... You know, just gotta make sure you don't die. That's a good hit. Just a good hit. Like <laughs> that. Let's see how it does on the uh, test. Okay, they're fine. I guess. Relatively. lands on his feet like every single time I mean it's just a damaged quarter panel like for real it's still drivable I wonder what would happen if I had traction control off. Oh, it actually freaking moves. for the best 0 to 60 I can. I got 4.72 seconds, that's pretty fine. I'm gonna see... how fast I can get going. Oh no. 
Oh. It's just a dent. Sorry. I'm gonna go without traction control and go for the best best time possible. Uh, uh don't worry about that. Putting, I put traction, contr traction control back on. And I'm just sending it. Dude, it keeps flipping. It's like my old scrap mechanic. Uh, Cars. But that's all right. Oh my god, it's dumping freaking it's dumping smoke everywhere. Not even just from the tires. <laughs> Alright, well, thank you guys for watching, and goodbye.